Hi everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. Wherever you're watching, may God bless you. How are you doing? So today I'm so grateful unto God because we are alive in the land of living more. Not a film that win it or him that run it, but of the Lord that trained mercy, the one that kept us alive. Let his name alone be highly exalted in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. My name is Ujuma Chiwan, and I want to appreciate all my subscribers. You guys are amazing. May God keep you in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. And if today is your first time, you are coming across of this channel, you are highly welcome. Please consider to subscribe to my YouTube channel and be part of this family. As I do so, may God bless you and keep you in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. So right now, before I proceed, I want to welcome the presence of God in our midst. Abba Father, we thank you for today. We thank you for your mercy. Come and have your way in our midst. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. So today, God gave me a word for someone and I hope this word is going to be a blessing to you. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Since last month, God gave me this word. So this message is very, very important. Hallelujah. Amen. God says, run. There is danger ahead of you. Run right now. There is danger ahead of you. And God don't want you to die before your time. That's why he said, run. Run to me because there is danger ahead of you. Hallelujah. Amen. You know, there's something that happened in the book of Jeremiah. When people of Israel became to like became arrogant in the presence of God. Bible said at a time they start committing fornication, adultery, playing harlot. And when God saw them, God became angry. You know, God so much loved people of Israel. He sent prophet Jeremiah to go and warn them. Hallelujah. Amen. For them to return because he said, I am married unto them. And when Jeremiah told them, our people of Israel, they keep doing what they are doing. And God's anger came upon them. Hallelujah. Amen. Right now, God is speaking to you. A married woman, a married man, sleeping with someone that is not your husband, that is not your wife, do you know that is a sin before God? Adultery, fornication, prostitution is a sin before God. This sin can cause sickness. This sin, this sin can cause damage in your life, in your destiny. Hallelujah. Amen. Don't say it, it doesn't matter. Other people, they are doing it. God hates it most. You need to keep yourself holy. Hallelujah, amen. Right now, God is saying, return to me. Because there is danger ahead of you. Don't allow that sin to kill you before your time. I pray it will never be your portion. In the name of Jesus Christ. First Corinthians chapter 6, verse 18, it says, Philip fornication, every sin that a man does is without the body but he that committed fornication sinned against his own body he that committed fornication sinned against his own body do you know that you are destroying your own body you are causing pain in your in, in your life that's why god said flee from it he said for you are bought with pride therefore glorify god in your body your body is the temple of Holy Spirit, respect God, honor Him. Hallelujah, Amen. As you honor God, as you respect Him in your body, God will honor you. God will respect you. God will grant your heart desires in the name of Jesus Christ, Amen. Book of Jeremiah, chapter three, verse twelve. He says, "Go and proclaim this way toward the north, and say." Return thou basely in Israel, says the Lord, and I will not cause my anger to fall upon you, for I am merciful, says the Lord. I will not keep anger forever. God is begging right now. He said, Return to me, run to me. He said, I will not keep anger forever. I will forgive you. Just come to God, He will forgive you. Right now, wherever you're watching, just open your mouth, begin to confess your sin. Say, God, I am sorry. God, I am sorry. Have mercy upon me. Watch me by your blood. Just confess your sin. Just confess your sin. I see the mercy of God right now upon someone. Just confess your sin. God is listening right now. Confess your sin. Tell God to deliver you from that negative lifestyle, from that lying, 
from that anger spirit. Tell God to deliver you from that spirit of fornication. Tell God to deliver you. Tell God to show you mercy. Open your mouth and pray. Tell God to show you mercy. Makalaba shandalaba. Tell God to show you mercy. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Right now, I pray for you. May God help you. May God wash you by, your, by his blood. May God cancel your name in the book of death and write your name in the book of life. May God deliver you from that spirit of fornication. From that negative lifestyle. In the name of Jesus Christ. May the mercy of God be upon you. In the name of Jesus Christ. I see God restoring you. Restoring your joy, your peace, your happiness. 